Linda Lopez is an expert analytical chemist, and we're talking about a technique that if you're involved with carbohydrate analysis, Linda, would you agree HPAE pad is an opportunity for them to take a look at? Yeah, it provides a really sensitive and selective method for the determination of carbohydrates. We can really take advantage of the fact that carbohydrates are weak acids in solution. They carry a negative charge, they're anions in solution, and so in a high pH medium, we can do ion exchange chemistry and really selectively separate those carbohydrates, stereoisomers, linkage isomers, branching isomers. Very nice line of carbopack columns permits such nice selectivity with very good sensitivity, which would be in the form of our pad detection, pulse dampermetric detection. Those anionic carbohydrates can be oxidized on the surface of a gold electrode, and the current is measured and it's proportional to the concentration of the carbohydrates in solution. Typically, customers will be looking at glycoprotein, so glycan analysis. We have customers in the food industry who who look at simple sugars, monosaccharides, disaccharides. We have customers in the biofuels industry who look at wood sugars and other sugars from fast-growing plants and trees that are used as raw materials for making alternative fuels. This permits direct accessibility, direct detection with no derivatization required for a molecule that has no chromophore. And alternative technologies, detection technologies, would really require them to do labor-intensive and expensive derivatization. This has no derivatization, very, very sensitive, 100 picomole detection limits are quite common, and it's a very powerful technique that leverages the selectivity of ion exchange chemistry. And the synergy with our chromatography platforms and the systems? We have the ICS 5000 Plus, which is a new product introduction for the show. Electrochemical detector is standard on that system, so fully capable of running the HPA pad analyses, delivering the precise electrolytically generated eluent at the precise pH that's required for the application. The ICS 4000 has an optional electrochemical detector. Electrochemical detector detectors permit the HPAE pad analyses. The systems are completely bioinert, they're metal free, they're made of peak, and so they can withstand these high pH ranges that the analysis is run at. And the phases, the ion exchange phases, are also stable across a very broad pH range from zero to about pH 14. You could never do that on a reverse phase uh, silica based column, you'd strip the phase. So not only are they very selective, very sensitive, they're very stable across the pH range required for the analysis. Learn more at thermoscientific.com slash dionics.